It's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Broughton Ales and it's the, the Gilly coming in at 4.5% ABV. There's the look of the label. Gold bottle cap. Let's get this beer out into a glass and see what we get there. Nice bit of smoke on the opening. Beer pouring out. It said it was a golden copper coloured ale and that's certainly what we're getting. There you go. It's about a three finger head on the beer. Nice levels of carbonation rising up the middle of the glass. Yeah, there you go. Slightly cloudy. It's not a perfectly bright beer, but hey ho, it's not really an issue. Let's get the aroma. Hmm. I'm getting a. It's a close call. This. It's. It's either a very sweet toffee. Or it's the dreaded butterscotch, which indicates diacetyl, which is an off flavour in the beer. The only way we're really going to find out is in the taste. Let's dive in. Cheers. No diastole whatsoever. My fears have been put to rest. This is a pretty decent beer. Quite a nice bitter beer from Broad Nails. Normally their beers are slightly more kind of traditional or the beers I've tried have been traditional. This one is really hopped up but in a very traditional hop, a British hop, not an American hop. Quite pithy, quite lemony, and it's like biting on a on a lemon that you've weirdly covered in spice first. It's like a spicy bitter lemon. It's very nice. It's very nice. It's very drinkable. It's a little bit, I was looking then, I, I took a second taste. I just wanted a bit of time out from talking just to really concentrate on the beer. And I was looking for sweetness from the malt. It was there, but then there's such a massive onrush of hop in the beer that it quickly kind of gets taken away and it, it's, it's back to that raw bitterness, that orange peel, lemon peel, spicy grapefruity taste I'm pretty sure it's not American hops let's have a look it doesn't say unfortunately the hop variety I'm pretty sure they've just hopped it up with a British variety yeah it looks Looks a nice product. It's got a little bit of lacing, that tiger lacing on the glass. Medium to very drinkable, refreshing mouthfeel. Not too sticky, not too kind of malty and, and, and heavy. It's just an altogether solid, tasty British brew. 
Okay. Brought nails. The guy. The guyly. Gilly. 4.5% ABV. How do we rate it? For a bitter, a best bitter, premium ale, if I saw it in a pub with Carlin, Foster's, Guinness, the regular beers, the regular mainstream beers that people drink, um, then I would drink this. If I seen it in perhaps a tap house or a bar, then I would probably have a half of it, see what it's like on, on cask, and then move on to something else. It's a 7 out of 10 beer. 7 out of 10 from Real Ale Craft Beer. Put your comments in the comments box. Please subscribe to our daily beer reviews, and cheers.